Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we're going to be talking about how you can start mining Terra Classic using your Windows based computer in 2024 in less than 10 minutes. So if all that sounds interesting to you, I do want to make sure to ask you to stick around through the entire video as there's a ton of different tips and tricks to allow you to earn more Terra Classic coin quicker and I'd hate for you to miss out on those tips. So with that being said, before we dive into the video today, I always do like to start off here on CoinMarketCap taking a look at what's going on in the crypto markets, just as a point of reference if you do happen to be watching this video in the future. As you can see, Bitcoin, crypto, it's down a little bit today, 1.47% across the board. Bitcoin's down about 3.34%. Ethereum's down just over a percent. Solana, 67 So, you know, overall down a little bit. You know, XRP's doing pretty well today. Dogecoin's up a little bit, but a lot of red, especially on the week still, uh, with a little bit of a pullback from the all-time highs that we saw just a little bit ago. Now, of course, I do want to take a look here at Terra Classic. Now it is actually up 2% or well, it was 2%, it 0.81% today uh, to about 0.000147. So of course, if you are familiar with you know what happened, there was a big drop off a couple years ago here where Terra used to be up in the $100 range and very quickly fell off to less than one penny. Now, with that being said, a lot of people are still believing in this coin. Binance is doing a big burn effort right now where they're burning tons and tons of this coin every month, um, which can be tracked at the uh, Terra Burn tracking site. But with that being said, a lot of people are trying to get into this coin, and this could be a good one to hold when the bull run does get here. And... In addition to faucets, one of the best ways to earn crypto is through GPU or CPU mining. Now, how do you go about mining a coin like Terra Classic where the total supply, circulating supply, you know, with the burns that have been taking place, they're about the same. This is not really a mineable coin. Well, there's actually a site out there called Unminable. This allows you to choose from many different algorithms and mine cryptocurrencies that are not traditionally mineable. So of course we're taking a look at Terra Classic here today and really if you want to get a head start in collecting this crypto, what you would need to do is first determine the algorithm that's most profitable for your computer. Now whether you're doing CPU or GPU mining with your Windows computer, you can go over to a site called whattomine.com and enter in the hardware that you have in your computer. That will then do all of the calculations for you based on the current market condition and tell you the most profitable algorithm to use for mining. With that being said, once you figure that out, you can come back to the site and go ahead and choose this get started with our wizard option. You're going to have two options here, basic and advanced. I recommend basic. That's what I'll be using. That's what I personally use. But if you want to specify your region, your port, and your worker name, you can go with the advanced option as well. Again, I'm going to be going with the GPU option here, but if you don't have a GPU or maybe you just want to mine with CPU, there is that option as well. The main difference is you're going to get a different selection of algorithms specific to CPU and different miners at the end as well. So GPU, I'm going to be mining with Kapow because I know that it's the most profitable for my hardware. If you happen to find a different algorithm that's better for your specific hardware, feel free to choose that here. Other than that, it's going to pretty much be the exact same process. Of course, we're mining Terra Classic, and at this point, you'll want to enter in your Terra Classic address. So I had it copied here before the video, but uh, now it doesn't seem to want to uh, be in my clipboard. So let me grab the file here and copy out my Terra address. So while I'm grabbing that, what I do want to say is please, please, please double check your Terra address. Make sure it is 100% correct because if you do enter in the wrong address here, you will not be able to get paid out. The way this works is you're going to mine coins to this address and then once you reach the minimum payment threshold here on the site, they will send you that payment once a day. 
to this address. So if you realize, you know, maybe you mine one, two, three thousand Terra Classic coins and you realize, oh, there was a typo in my address, you're not going to be able to get those Terra that you have mined. You can always come back and create a new file, but you will not be able to transfer those coins. So once you confirm that, you are pretty much at the end here. There's one last step before downloading the miner, and that is the referral code. Now, in the description below is the link to Unminable, as well as my referral code, which is just Bitcoin-tips. If you do want to use this referral code, it actually helps both of us out. It does help out the channel because you are using that code, but it also helps you out in that the regular fee here on Unminable is 1%. So if you mine 100 Terra Classic coins, you will only get 99. One of those coins will go to the site. And if you use this referral code, you're actually going to lower that fee by 0.25%, and you'll only be paying a 0.75% fee. So while it isn't a huge discount, every little bit does help, and to me, I look at it as you're helping out the channel, and you're getting a little bit of extra money at the same time, so it's a win-win for everyone. So again, the referral code is just Bitcoin-tips, just like you see on screen. If you're not interested in using that, go ahead and say continue without referral code, but you will be paying that full fee. So at this point, you are at the very end. The last step is to download the miner and start mining. Now, at this point, you can choose whatever miner you want. As you can see, there's a decent selection here. I personally like G-Miner. It works with both NVIDIA and AMD GPUs, and it's worked really well for me in the past. Now, if you do decide to go with something different, just make sure that it is compatible with your GPU. Of course, Team Red is for AMD only, T-Rex is NVIDIA only, but just keep that in mind. So once you choose your miner, you will have to select Download Miner Files. It's going to redirect you to the GitHub where you download this file. It is a compressed file .zip, so you will have to extract it before you can start mining. The other thing I do want to call out is the .bat file download as well. So once you download that uh, miner files, you're going to need to download your .bat file and drag and drop it into the same folder that your mining files extracted into. Now, when you go to download these, you may get an error on your browser saying, hey, you're downloading an unverified file. Do you want to delete this? Um, you will have to say, no, I want to continue downloading it. This is something that is just a part of mining, whether you're using Unminable or a different platform. You're pretty much always going to get this pop-up. That's mainly because mining programs look very similar to real viruses. I can personally confirm that I've been using this program for many years on personal computer mining rigs, and I've never had any issues. But if you are not comfortable with doing that, it's your computer, your decision. Unfortunately, there is no workaround for it. So I do like to call that out as well. But once you get your file downloaded, as you can see here, I have unminable-lunc-kapow-gminer, pretty much the whole setup. What you'd have to do at this point is just double click this to get it started. Now you will see again here um, that, well, I guess it didn't do it. I've had it running before, but you will get a Windows Defender pop-up. Again, you're going to have to say more info and run anyway. It's another warning, uh, you know, just because of the type of file. And again, if you are not comfortable with doing that, then don't. It's that simple, but unfortunately, there is no workaround. But as you can see here, we are, according to the clock, 8 minutes and 46 seconds into the video. And that includes an intro and looking at coin market cap, but we are mining. LUNC coin using a RTX 2080. It is that simple in less than 10 minutes to start mining crypto, specifically Terra Classic here on Unminable with Windows 10 or 11. So just a few last things I do like to mention here on mining. It does take about 15 to 30 minutes for any statistics to show up here on the site when you switch over to your address. That is completely normal. It does take some time. Don't panic if you don't see it right away. And on the other end, when you decide, hey, you know, I'm done mining for the day or I need to use the computer, something like that, all you need to do to close this out is just bring up the CMD window and hit the X. It will go away if it's not on your taskbar. It is fully closed. 
it will take 30 minutes to an hour for your worker to disappear off this dashboard and you may actually still earn LUNC coins in that time. Don't worry, if it is closed, you are no longer mining. It's just kind of how it works and, you know, it's, hey, you're still earning and you're not even mining. So, uh, but I have seen some questions about that before. So with that being said, please feel free to get mining here on Unminable. Again, the link is down below with my referral code to save you that extra little bit on the pool fee. And if you do run into any issues or have any questions throughout the full process, please feel free to leave a comment on this video. Always happy to try and help troubleshoot and fix any issues with your miner so that you can get started mining today. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I do hope to see you in my next video. Bye.